Last week, the noted baseball philosopher Lewis Linwood Voigt said the following about the Yankees. I almost feel like it's embarrassing for us, and guys have lost their confidence, and we've got to get back to who the New York Yankees are. I feel like teams really aren't scared of us right now. Those were blunt words from Luke Voigt, who is obviously much better known as a power-hitting first baseman than a baseball philosopher. There was anguish in Voigt's voice because he couldn't believe how the Yankees were faltering. So he spoke the truth, the hard truth. It was actually refreshing to hear. Actions, not words, are why teams play better. But soon after Voigt wondered why the Yankees were no longer intimidating anyone, they won six straight games and regained some of their swagger. During the streak, Yankee starters have a tiny 1.72 ERA. Garrett Cole looks dominant again and angry, too. Good signs for October. Masahiro Tanaka resembles a pitching surgeon. Davey Garcia is the coolest 21-year-old in the Bronx and should follow those two in a postseason rotation. Jay Happ has surged by using his two-seam fastball with his four-seamer. Jordan Montgomery has the mix of pitches to be reliable. And the offense has awakened and has been led quite often by Voigt, who leads the majors with 18 homers and leads the Yankees in runs batted in and candid quotations. Glaber Torres has regained his timing and, with or without sunglasses, is an elite hitter. DJ LeMahieu is a rock star in the leadoff spot. Clint Frazier is vastly improved and deserves to continue getting consistent at-bats. As the Yankees peak, they are also getting strong reinforcements. Gio Urshela returned last night and immediately made a Greg-like Nettles play at third base. Giancarlo Stanton is back as well in that cleanup spot. And Aaron Judge returns tonight against the Blue Jays out in right field and in the number two spot in the lineup. It's a lineup that scored 20 runs last night, and now it has become even more dangerous. Meanwhile, the bullpen arms are looking powerful, which is critical for a postseason with fewer days off. The Yankees have a stranglehold on a playoff bird, but with six of their final 12 games against the Jays, they can cement their spot in second place or do even better. If the Yankees can climb to the fourth seed in the AL, they will host a wild card series at Yankee Stadium where they are 19 and 7. Listen, I'm not saying Voigt's words are why the Yankees have had a revival, but I am saying he described what everyone knew. The disappointing play had to stop, and it did. The Yankees' turnaround coincided with Lewis Linwood Voigt dropping truth bombs and Luke Voigt hitting some home run bombs. His words might be as memorable as any that are uttered this season.